Yo, 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 what is up, Halo community? I hope you're all having a fantastic day. So there's been so many leaks going out right now. Um, I don't know what the heck is happening, but this is insane. The Falcon has made its glorious return. Now, we don't exactly know when this is going to return, but I'm going to assume it's probably going to come out around the time when the Battle Royale launches. Now, of course, it is untextured uh, and unfinished, but man, dude, I cannot believe we're actually getting the Falcon. This is like one of the vehicles that has been requested the most, I feel like, by the Halo community. And for a good reason, because it's a really fun, enjoyable vehicle. And it's awesome how you're able to transport troops and stuff like that. And so it does come with a slight twist. As you can see, it has the grenade launcher on the left side. And it has the chain gun turn on the right side, so it's kind of like a hybrid kind of uh, Falcon. I am curious if there's going to be a variant where you get like the front gunner, uh, you know, where you get the gun on the front for like the pilot to shoot and stuff. So another cool addition is an update to the passenger seat. As you can see, you can actually like shoot from it and you go in third person like this is absolutely insane. Now I do want to give a shout out to Halo Leaks as they went ahead and leaked this. I believe the original leaker, his, his Twitter name is uh, Halo Versions, uh, but I'll be giving uh, all credits in the description down below of course. So on to the next leak, we actually got a leaked gameplay of the Quantum Translocator, which is a new equipment. Now this one does seem a little more finished, uh, you actually got like the icon, oh never mind it literally, literally says no icon, but anyways we get to see how it works. And as you can see, he kind of places down like a little portal uh, checkpoint thing. And whenever he press it, presses the equipment button, it kind of like teleports him there. So it's kind of like a save checkpoint, honestly, is the best way I could describe it. Uh, you know, you set it up and then if you're like falling off a map or if you're getting like, up, or if you're like about to die, uh, you kind of just hit the equipment button and it teleports you back. I'm not going to lie. I think this will be great for customs, but in multiplayer, this is probably gonna be annoying it could possibly be like the new armor lock it might be like the armor lock 2.0 so shout out to delta index for uh leaking the quantum translocator gameplay but yeah let me know your guys's uh thoughts on this i mean i'm just like incredibly excited for all this stuff and of course like the video and consider subscribing as i'll keep you guys updated on uh halo content like this that being said i'll see you guys on the next one peace